The Corruption Commission has heard that the former Premier put her colleagues at risk of having conflicts of interest by not disclosing her relationship with Daryl Maguire. The claim was made by the Deputy Premier John Barillaro before he was then questioned about whether he always followed the rules. John Barillaro left the ICAC adamant the former Premier isn't in the same category as others who've come into its crosshairs. Now we've seen, of course, you know, Eddie Obeid, etc., uh, being sentenced. Um, Gladys is a person of high integrity. I I've always believed it and I still continue to believe it. Uh, but no, there's no corruption. He says his only concern was that when the Expenditure Review Committee considered a project in Daryl Maguire's electorate, then Treasurer Gladys Berejiklian didn't disclose she was in a relationship with him, putting others at risk of conflict too. I, in one way, could argue that I had a conflict of interest if I had known there was a relationship. So there is a ripple effect of conflicts uh, that we would have had to manage. John Barillaro told the Commission the Clay Target Association's proposal still had merit and had the relationship been disclosed, it's likely it still would have been funded just through a different process. Mr Barillaro said while it's the job of all MPs to advocate for their community, Mr Maguire's style was more aggressive than most. Describing an email to his office titled, Here We Go on the Merry-Go-Round Again, as typical Daryl. A typical Daryl would be to be quite vociferous in his advocacy of projects that he wanted to get across the line. So it's, a, it's, a, it's a pain in the ass. Um, he was very, very strong local member and, and uh, someone that really didn't um, let go. It was a dog of the bone. Yeah. Ms Berejiklian's lawyer shifted the focus to Mr Barillaro himself and whether he'd always complied with disclosure rules. What about any other intimate personal relationships with Mr Barillaro? Um, I don't think that is a, a normal... Some, I, that's a hard question because my, my relationship were with my family. So that's a hard one to, to disclose. I think what happens in someone's personal life, and, and if, if that was the case with, with the Premier, it wouldn't have mattered. Uh, but because we were making in decisions that benefit uh, an individual um, in a political way, not, not beyond that, um, that just that makes it more complicated. Gladys Berejiklian will be questioned about the complexities of her relationship later this week. Kathleen Calderwood, ABC News, Sydney.